Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. I am Jacqueline Renee. If this is your first time ever viewing any one of my videos, welcome, welcome, welcome. If you are a returning subscriber, welcome back. So um, today I have a DW Home candle haul for you guys. I fell in love with DW Home candles when I picked up a few from, I think it was TJ Maxx. I picked up a few from TJ Maxx and I decided to look at the bottom of the candle to see where the candle came from and all that. Went online, found out there was a website. Why? Why did I find out there was a website? And now I have made a purchase. I ordered 10 candles. 10 candles. And then this weekend I went shopping with my mom and my brother. And my brother needed something from, I think it was Marshalls. We went to Marshalls. And I bought three candles, well, no, four candles Saturday. And then my candle shipment that I did online, the 10 candles I ordered online, came yesterday. So I have 14 candles. I do not need any more candles for the year. For the year. Okay? So let's start with the candles that I picked up from Marshalls in store. So the first candle is this Lily Blossom candle. It's the three wick. It was $7.99. And then the compare price, this compare price is right. The compare right price for is $14. Um, if you go online, the three wick, no, no it's not. I think the three wick candles are $16 and then you have a two wick candle that's 14 and then the one wick candle is $12. So this compare price might not be right, but you can always look it up. But I got it from Marshalls for $7.99. This smells so damn good, okay? The um, notes for this is a scent of spring blossom, lily pebbles with hints of purple pizzazz um passion wood and sheer vanilla musk that is the lolly blossom candle this candle smells so good i've been burning this candle in the office the next candle i picked up in store was the jasmine ivory not ivory brain for it but you see it right <laughs> this candle was $6.99 in store this is a one wick candle so it probably was $12 online um, the notes for this is wrapped in luscious um, flowers and sweet vanilla orchids with wood undertones which is true I do smell like some wood undertones and I smell the um the orchid I smell the orchid I really don't smell vanilla though but that's what they say with the notes but this smells like it could really go in the bathroom it has that clean clean linen smell that's what this smell like to me the next one I picked up in store is the pony pebble Hmm. The scent, the notes on this is sparkling sun, um, blends of dew, covered pony, uh, illuminated, illuminated by crisp notes of garden rose, sugared finesse, and bright majestics. Which, this is the two wick. I do smell roses definitely smell roses um roses stand out to me i don't know about all the other stuff but roses stands out to me this candle was 7.99 the last candle i picked up in store is this um everyday lux um whiskey and cedar wood soy blend candle 
I don't think this one is by DW Homes. Now that I look at it, I don't think this one is by DW Homes, but this is a three wick. Um, it smells woodsy. Woodsy with some must. But it's a three wick and it was $6.99. But this smells good. So smell all the candles. When you go over there, smell all of them. But lately I've been drawn to DW Home candles. All right, so we're going to start with the candles that I got in my shipment. Now, this is the candle that started it all. I, I found the smaller one wick candle of this candle in a Marshalls. And that what made me go and find out how I can get more. So this is the two wick. I ordered the two wick. Two wick one. And this is white. No, pep. Paper white vanilla. This smells so damn good. Let me tell you what the notes are. I wrote them down. There's so many of them. I wrote them down. Um, the notes for this is soft white, soft paper white petals and red currants with hints of sweet vanilla. And I smell sweet vanilla and pebbles definitely sweet vanilla though this is something you probably will burn in the spring summer it smells good though if you see this candle just pick it up in the store and smell it come back to this video and say jackie you are right this smells so damn good that's the first one from my shipment The second one is the black currant. Uh, this is a wood wick candle. I didn't know it was a wood wick. I didn't really look at it. I love these tops. These wood wick tops, they are so cute. Um, this is the jar. It smells so good. It says plum black currants and bright winter berries. Embrace of harvest, harvest peach. Wrapped with crushed sage leaves and vibrant greens. I smell the wood and it does have a, a berry smell oh and it has the scent notes right here on the top this smells really good and this this is a wood wick candle okay the next one is vanilla bean and this is so popular on YouTube so popular it is um, fragrance vanilla beans blended with a hint of cream vodka splash of butter cream frosting sweet spawn sugar and a dash of aromatic spice don't they just make you feel like i'm gonna light this candle in my room and have a baby or get impregnated with a baby like all of those sit notes was just like damn you like this on a very romantic night and you get it on like seriously so this is the one wick this reminds me of like buttercup and i forgot who makes buttercup no 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 yeah buttercup that's the name of the camera buttercup but i forgot who makes it but this smells so good this smells like a pound cake like you're ready to eat somebody's baking a pound cake that's what this really smells like and that's the vanilla bean the next one is evergreen forest I love the way this this jar looks it, I love the colors how this blends together evergreen forest fresh evergreens and dewy green moss wet florals and and warm leather I smell the warm leather this is a winter candle so I probably will not light this until winter comes back around but this smells so good it reminds me of a man's cologne and I can't remember the name of the man's cologne right now but I'm pretty sure my daddy used to wear it but this smells so good uh, sugar current is the next one 
bright current um bright currents uh berry splash and sun rise complement by sugar citrus vibrant greens and tender berry blossom that is the sugar current so one wick i love these tops i do not like to blow my candles out when i'm done with them or whatever i just put the top on it and let the top smother the um lit because i don't like that burnt smell when you blow out a candle that messes up the fragrance in the room oh but this this smells so good the next one is that's sugar current okay this is fresh current it says sweet plus electric And I love this top. This top is flimsy. It's one of those plastic type. Well, it's not even plastic. I don't know what this material is, okay? But it's the flimsy. And, oh, just doing that, you get the scent of the candle. <sighs> this smells so good. It says fresh red currants and sun, sun ripped, splashed over vibrant greens, sugar centrist, and touch of warm berry bark. Warm berry bark. And it has the DW home print in the cap. Can you see that? It smells so good. And surprisingly, I ordered really good scents because I couldn't smell it before I bought it, right? So surprisingly, I ordered really good scents. This is sparkling cranberry. It's the one wick. And I got things in one wicks, so if I didn't like it, it was just a one wick. So one wicks were $12. Um, two wicks were $14, and then the three wicks was between $16 and $18. It depends on what it was. But um, if I like these, you know, like the scents and all that, I can order the two wick or the three wick whenever I want to. So sparkling can cranberry. Is sun ripped cranberries and subtle black berries splashed over vibrant greens. So, a whole bunch of these, you know what? And I'm starting to think the ones that are like, I guess, for winter or warmer weather type scents all have vibrant greens. So, now I know that. It smells so good. And you know, I never see these in stores. Like um, the ones I know I haven't saw in store is the ones that I ordered from the website. Because when you go to the store, it's hit or miss. You know, you're only getting what's out there. But when you go on the website, you can order whatever you want. This one is Paradise Escape. I saw a YouTuber with this candle lit in her kitchen, right? And I think it was Nitra B. So if you watch Nitra B, one of her Christmas vlogs, she had this candle lit in her kitchen. And the notes for this is tropical plumbed um, pellets infused with golden pineapple, juice, juicy papayas, and sweet garve. Oh, this is sweet. This is a sweet candle. So if you like sweet candles, this is the one for you but it smells really good the next one is our lavender um caramel caramel this is blends of fragrance lavender and soothing um car caramel with notes of hmm with notes of a hint of wild must i smell the must where would i put this candle it smells good don't get me wrong it smells good but where would i put this because it the must kind of overpowers the lavender 
this is good for a living room right by the front door this scent hitting you coming into the house yeah because i smell the must the must it kind of overpowers the lavender but it smells good the last candle is the apple honey butter and look at that i like the color of the um wax it matches the jar this is a christmas candle if you see this candle pick it up save it to christmas off the back i can smell cinnamon cinnamon is in this candle the notes are brown sugar glazed apples blend with warm cinnamon golden cloves and granted granulated um, nutmeg wrapped in sweet caramel honey drizzled in dr drizzles of hints of pure maple syrup I could definitely smell um, the cinnamon the cinnamon in this so this will be a for sure winter candle as well I can't see myself burning this during the summer but if you like to smell um, cinnamon during the summer go right ahead it's your damn candle do what you want to do so that is it for my dw home haul i hope you guys enjoyed all what 14 candles that i showed you um hopefully this is it like if i see a candle in store that um i do not own right now and it smells good i'm going to try to resist buying them but it's kind of hard but i'm gonna try i'm gonna try really hard so um i also have a facebook page well a facebook group where i do live videos of makeup and we talk about avon we talk about life experiences we talk about business because I have um, people in my group that are business-minded women. We talk about a lot of things. So just don't catch me on YouTube. You can also catch me on Facebook. My Facebook group is Enhanced Beauty by Choice. Um, find us on Facebook. Join the group. Answer the three little simple questions. And you will be um, granted access into the group. So until the next time I upload a video. If this is your first time, subscribe. You know you want to subscribe. Subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.